if you see Mustafa for you, Bandi, and Ninkomo. Um, and now we are and as an opaque one, a shas here, or share a year papers, a hoodwa publications and a buy now offer daily dispatcher, a beneficent paper. They say, arm yourselves with cutlasses if you are going to vote NDC guru or not. They are what they buy, you know. Then daily guide, no mommy daily guide, um, Freddie Blay paper, no, and so the buyer say. NDC presses panic button and also a hanum empty just less than one hour ago. Any call Ghana, uh, yeah, Ghana police service on my Facebook, uh huh, Ghana police service on my Facebook, and I just say a two ya el ho, say one more say one more a start investigation about Ura Mustafa for your bandy and send me our cocky car or okay FM. Mustafa, I'm not so you don't need to come on. You missed and say, I saw when you call me a fee, a kufu dampare, and then I swear for you. What do you mean? Can't watch it. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. I'm not sure that BBA will call you. I see. Um, um, hello, sir. Ban, eh, minim, sir. When you're not prepared, you say, be a win, you're being sure, yeah. I'm out for draw attention, say when a radio station be a grantee interview. Na on say me a kind no Ghana police service for say Omar Sumoa one more year investigation. I crack what I want. And when you tell me, sir, from Ghana police service, yo, me da se minu ya, me da wase. Acha ya tiye phone suni na aji. Na ni wo mne se ni ame pa na abe. The motive behind every action, every conduct. Is to bring sanity and public order. Near open abbey, near open abbey. What you must say? Yeah, found the woman and that you may have you. The matter is very simple. Yako, this is assembly elections. Apino Marquis are only a member of the Ghana Armed Forces, MP. Police for a deploy officers to police the election. Or no team and so you are the Oma co a foot two constituency, or ma co attacking co for intimidating or more baby and Timian Twaba. How a concern a minister for fishers or no team and a mantia or mosha case K nine. Sa police unit uniform now, Omade and Kraman and Amorna. Ah, Ubeka, you are so west Wagona. National security. I take responsibility that we will be functioning. Some of them were deployed into Kaswa to the extent that they threatened the life of the parliamentary candidate there. I know, okay, if I'm fair, I'm going to say, look, these are the infractions that took place by actors of the sitting government with the knowledge of the president. So, apart from police deployment, government officials have deployed the military into the consequences with the sole aim of attacking and intimidating innocent people. And as such, those people should be arrested in accordance with law. But if we don't have that situation, it means that there's a likelihood that we see the human staff to innocent people. What it means is that we will not go to any police station without defending ourselves. Because we were not fighting. Omo to abaya every county and omo jina ho. Ena police poko to chuo chuo kuu omo. Enti oko police station now the county asha omo now do jina ho. Oto abaya ni ya na uoche. As for vigilance, it doesn't matter what they will do. The NDC will be vigilant going into 2024. No amount of intimidation will stop anybody. I am willing to surrender and to comply with the police. As long as that will help the matter to be investigated, so that all persons who have brought up infractions of the law will be dealt with in accordance with the law, I, Mustafa, I am ready. Any day that I have to go down for the NDC to prevail out of fairness and a transparent election, I am ever ready. No amount of intimidation will work with me. I see. Eighty, eighty, eighty. Say now, can seven or ten? You are members of me who say. Say, I am a car. Report. Uh huh. As I read you, I can find no more Christian. Anna, stop with them. We can grant it. I can find no Christian. I would say, I would say. If one can find no more, or 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 more,
they should take catalysis and guns to police station. If they don't declare John Mahama a winner, they should kill people. What nonsense and what you know lazy journalism is that? I didn't say that. But what I said is that if they don't arrest Howard Kumsin and Apenio Marquis, this is not his first time. I say not. Or the military buyer, I have to counter them. Where does he get the military officers from? Who told the government that apart from police deployment, any official can deploy the military into election? Are there no infractions into the, the, the security arrangements of the, the elections so that we cannot have a free and fair election? Now, the the police, I'm sure, is responding to MPP for questions and one more one more answers. I am ever ready to lead any investigation to arrest our Kumsin and to arrest Apenio Marquez. We are all Ghanaians, that no one will be treated as a foreigner and nobody will be intimidated. Enough of the intimidation. Not just a Samna Okarani or Pitu Hai, any headlines, you know, and any boy Brio, and any foul. Nine people for Maka and Okrebida. The people are going to opposition. The product of the assembly election, the outcomes have based the entire government machinery. Local government minister constituency. We lose, we have never won since 2000 in that constituency. Pro NDC assembly members. He has 21 electoral areas. We won uh, 12. Aka won nine. Nine Okrano. We are investigating to see the Avavrantopo and Kahuana. The local government minister's constituency. He, Okaiko Central, Patrick Buamaho. NPP, NDC, pro NDC used to have zero. Omo of five electoral areas. About two, we are winning four. Omo of one. Pe. If you check the entire outcome of the assembly election, the NDC is effectively controlling the grassroots of this country. And no amount of intimidation will change that. The people are going to vote against corruption. The people are going to reject Akufado and his machinery for all the criminality they have conducted, the hardship they have brought on the people of this country. They have rejected the lie of one village, one dam. They have rejected government for lying that you give every constituency, one constituency, one million dollars, which turned out to be fraud. All those things, people will vote against them. And that is the outcome you saw. And then Mustafa no here give it. So if they are days, they should go and plan how to exit government. As for 2024, what will cost from the NDC will come to power. You I, got up hardship. People cannot even eat. We are going to Christmas. National health insurance has collapsed. Get fund has collapsed. Hospitals are not working. And you think that the ordinary Ghanaian who pay tax will forgive this inept and this incompetent, corrupt, arrogant government? Now who can they think that they have power to intimidate anybody? We are ready any day. I see. But as a political party, it's been three years. Yakotu Aba, Nipa Makumakumwaki, Asuja for Bobinum to Kumwom. And much Rokata Kogana Police Service, a Bisa investigation so far, Babio Modru, because an Asamo Tanahon Mama, your election year. If the police were ever interested in any investigation, I'm going to NDV to write a letter to find out. Because killing innocent people is so painful that the families are still going through pain. You have just denied a family of their destiny helpers. And this government is not humbled by this conduct that have disgraced the whole country. And they are still doing it. When did he come into politics? What has he given this country? What is his relevance to this country that he can deploy military with arms to go and intimidate people? How are Kumsel? The only thing she has done in this country is to steal corruption. There is a woman who led the one village, one dam project that they took World Bank money and chopped. This woman, we should sit down. 2020 or two two will be answered. Musicians, the artists, executive, or mafia, police, what you want? Are politicians better than ordinary Ghanaians? Mm. Is how are important than any Ghanaian? That she can mobilize national security operatives to invade into a constituency where the police have assured they say there will be enough security to ensure a legal free election, ordinary disassembly election. Now, or as I said here, what to me they are so they are four on the constituency. Me are quite intimidating convoy, and we should sit down and keep quiet. Everyone in the NDC can be coward and quiet. I will not be quiet. I'm willing to be sacrificed for what is expedient for the just of this country, what is necessary for ensuring that the writing is done. I am ever ready any day. I will accept that investigation to ensure that the officials of government 
who deploy the military and national security into the election are also dealt with in accordance with law. So forget these people who are dazed by the outcome of assembly election and circulating lies. A daily guide, would they ever say anything that is truthful? Mm. Can you see this guy? You don't take him serious. A friend is saying. Daily dispatch. Well, yeah, uh, Beneficent. Bakuno Beneficent. Yeah. Do you even think Beneficent, you take him serious? Do you take Ben Epstein serious? This is a rented journalist who has lack of morals and values. His principles work in one way. He doesn't work in double ways. Every principled person is like a double-edged sword. Uh, uh, he daily dispatch, if anything. Ben Epstein doesn't have those morals. So what would he write? He is not afraid of an individual who can commandeer the military to invade into a constituency. But he's afraid of me saying that we will defend ourselves. I stand on what I have said. And I say that they have twisted my comments. But what I insist is that if those people are not arrested and dealt with, the NDC will not encourage Ghanaians to go to fooling stations where MPP government officials will deploy military to go and shoot them. We have precedents. There are evidence that are all over the place. And you think we should be quiet? Mm. That part, I swear that for after I'm really easy when saying our Facebook when you call me from Ghana Police Service. Minia, what's that? Yeah, me, nobody intimidates me. Mm. I no cry about it. I will not break a law. Okay, if by any means, any day I break a law, I expect the law to deal with me. Mm. I will not be afraid of this corrupt government and its functionaries when they call me. I will. Tender myself immediately to assist in investigation. Mm. I'm waiting for that call to come. Immediately, I will tender myself to assist in investigation so that Howard Kumson and Antonio Marquis will be arrested. I have evidence. If they like, they should let us proceed on that target. Okay. Muzaba, you're pretty. You're doing this. You're not doing this. Bibiani, you're not being sarcastic. You're not being Okay. Mbandi, uh, Deputy General Secretary. And they see this one more statement about Facebook, uh, and now one more Ekika and Seminole Hanum, but uh, Mamma share, Sammy Timmy, a kind, the Omo, 